day number three, 55 in the 55 on Route 66. We are still in Missouri, but we're heading to Kansas and then Oklahoma, leaving the boots court early in the morning. It's a little gray out, but uh, it's not gonna stop us. Route 66 in the 55, come on. past the Boots Course of Pancake Hut. <laughs> and a block away from the Pancake House, look at this sign. Plymouth DeSoto neon sign. and look at here wow nice the route 66 drive-in theater all right i gotta get some pictures the web city chamber of commerce the route 66 center But it's not open. All right. Web City. Route 66. And the historic Route 66 byway. All right. Back on the road. Downtown Web City. Uh, Route 66 Theater. Oh, look at that old building. Joplin, Missouri. Wilder Steakhouse. Look at the sign. Wow. AAA approved. It's got to be good if it's AAA approved, right? Get a picture of that beauty. Route 66 byway ends? What do you mean it ends? The old gas station, the state line, Hogs and Hot Rod Saloon. Here we go, Kansas 66, we are in Kansas. All right, got the gas station on that side. Look at the mural. Look at this old ad. J.H. Smith Lumberyard. Henry. Henry someone. And the Palace Drugstore. Got a couple pictures here. This is the old Front Street Garage. I love this building. Love this building. And then right across the street, the Can O Tex. Cars on Route 66. Cars on the route. Got a couple pictures of that. They got some wreckers and 
There you go. Cano Tex, Kansas Route 66, and the Front Street Garage. Look at that thing. Awesome. And it looks like, is it seriously? Looks like it says up there 1896. Wow. All right, Front Street. Whoa. It's in Kansas. I thought they were after me for a second. Thank goodness they're not. And there's the, uh, that's back to Missouri. We're taking Route 66 and that away. All right. Oh, I got to get a picture of this for Buck. There you go, Dr. Buck, Buck's Recreation. Let me get a picture for you, buddy. All right, got the Buck's Recreation sign. Love that. And now we're off to find, there's a, this was the Will Rogers Highway. And there's a Will Rogers Highway marker up here in the park that I want to check out. There was even a promotion, it was for a movie, but there was a promotion years ago. US 66, Galena, Kansas, the Will Rogers Highway, named for the award produced, Galena Lead Minings, there you go, Will Rogers Highway, dedicated in 1952 to Will Rogers, humorous, rural traveler, good neighbor, this Main Street of America Highway 66 was the first road he traveled in a career that led him straight to the hearts of his countrymen. Will Rogers Highway marker here on Route 66. There you go, Route 66 roadside attraction, Pappy Litch Park, Galena, Kansas. In 2001, members of the community joined with the Galena Chamber of Commerce to donate, donate a block of the downtown Route 66 Main Street, a park for everyone to enjoy. There you go. The Main Street of America with Will Rogers Highway Marker. From Pappy Litch Park, Oh man, look at the Texaco sign. Oh wow, that's pretty cool. Stop in for a quick picture. Well, I just got invited to pull in. I am Jeff. I'm Jack. Jack? Where are you from? Uh, exactly. Tell me about this place. Well, Gearhead Curios? Well, I'm, I'm not the owner. You need, okay. you need to talk to the owner. All right, we're going inside to talk to the owner. All right. Sky Chief Texaco, I love the neon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're being interviewed. Oh, geez. Being How are you? I'm Jeff Fisted. How you doing? Never better. How are you, sir? What's your name? I'm Aaron. Aaron? Yep. Can you give me a little thumbnail history of the, of the joint? I was left unattended. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. <laughs> so in my 58 Ford pulled in five years ago to take pictures and saw a for sale by owner sign in the window. Really? But what I got was a lot of opportunity. As in where our restroom is now, which is unique, and you'll need to see the restroom. It was a forest, and there was holes in the roof. We had to start by deforesting, taking the roof off, down to walls. And deforesting. Deforesting. As in we cut trees down and we... All right, let me stumps. see this. Show, show me this. Show me this. All right. So. Oh, wow. This right here, I don't know how the glare will get with your camera. There's a for sale sign right there. Awesome. Where's the Ford? Uh, at home right now. Okay. It's probably in the shop. Th this was Ford. the roof. Sorry. I, you, you didn't hear that. <laughs> I had to, I had to dig out. I was going to say, I got an oval we could hang on. Your yeah, right. Picture. That's why I don't have any friends. <laughs> That's where the restroom is right now. Wow. Fantastic. This right here is where this is now. So oh, on the nice. side of our building, this right here. 
33 Chevy we cut out of the woods. <laughs> Fantastic. And then as you look up, every license plate on the ceiling has been gifted to us by travelers. And how long have you owned this? Or Five years this month. That's it? Yeah. Amazing. Oh, the, the picture I was showing, yeah. The, the, here it is. You have done a hell of a job. Here you go. Here's a picture <laughs> with no roof. Oh, wow. Topless. So we literally wow. took it down there. But the restroom tour. We are famous for our restroom. So <laughs> Just like Bucky's. Yeah. Better. So old service station. Oh the God. restroom key was on a hubcap. So we have a 1963 AMC Rambler. My dad out there building a barn door sliding door. So I had to fabricate a latch. So when you shut it, it automatically locked, justifying a key, which is nothing more than a half-inch nut driver, just so I could have the hubcap. Love it. So this way. Oh my God. Come on into the restroom. We had a pink 1950s toilet, pink and white checkerboard floor. And then from there we go gearhead, C-clamp with wrenches from a toilet paper holder. Nice, okay. Model A Ford hood sides as my divider. <laughs> and that's our baby. Powder coated funnel is the urinal. Those are so you know where to put your feet. This is the flush. <laughs> We sell t-shirts that says, I hit the funnel like Gearhead Curios. For our ladies, we don't want to leave them out. We're the only place that offers this. There you go. So they can stand, hit the funnel, let the world <laughs> know what they did, and then buy a t-shirt. So our awesome. sink is an oil drain basin with a brass gas pump nozzle. Wrenches that hold everything in place. Walmart foaming hand soap and an oil can. My 58 Ford. That I was driving. This is the radiator that used to be in it. Oh, nice! Outside, you'll see the big boy statue. If you're familiar with big boys, they're yeah. burger joints. The burger is holding the tires because we texacoized him. The tires are the tires that were on my '58 the day I found this place for sale. Oh, very cool! I love how you tied everything in. Oh, oh yeah, valve cover. '59 Ford valve cover, GM air cleaner from the '60s. Now, if oh. you're a GM guy, everybody agrees that they believe that's GM, but no one has said, "Hey, that's a '63 Skylark." So. What's unique is that's the top, but it's got the sides and the snorkel. Yeah. Everyone agrees with me that we believe it's a GM, but no one knows what. So, so if, if you, you know. Could, if you know what, leave a comment. What, let us know. Leave a comment. 1930s headlight buckets. Awesome. And then as we awesome. step back out here, you'll notice motorcycle helmet lights, gas pump nozzle lights. I and, love the motorcycle helmet lights. Yeah, you have the difference between a poor quality and a high quality light. The or helmet, rather. And the helmet that's high quality doesn't let the light through. The poor quality makes it better. And this man. is built when? 1939. Made 1939. Made of stone. This brick is 1890s. That's the building next door. 1890s? Yes. Wow. And then... Oh, uh, I'll, I will fill up at that price, yeah. please. Yeah. <laughs> as you're in here, you also find that you breathe better. <laughs> yeah. So the reason why that you breathe better is because when you're walking around... You're breathing filtered air. You can see the air being filtered. Ah, that's high tech. <laughs> high tech, scientific. Look at that. That is. Yeah, this used to be two restrooms in here. Love that. This is amazing. And thank you so much for, yeah, thank for this. You. you got a hell of a grip. I've been, oh. I've been renovating an old Texaco. No. <laughs> oh, the thing. Hang on. Lots of stuff going on in here. Oh, no. You got to take those things off. Those are for delivery only. Are they? Yes. Oh, it's a rent car. <laughs> take them off. Well, it looks quite all right. It protects it. Nah, it's for delivery only. Sorry. Ah, there's the Bob's Big Boy. Nice. Galena, Kansas. He's a Chevy guy. I'm surprised he's not drooling over your car. That's he's working. He's hard at work. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he hasn't had a chance to. Uh, to take oh, and he's taking. You're even taking. You're funny. Uh, I, I'm awesome. gonna post, man. I'm a car guy. Thanks, I, man. I hardly ever get pictures of people, but their cars. <laughs> oh yeah. All right, I got to get a couple pictures. Jefferson Highway, roadside attraction, Gearhead Curios, Galena, Kansas, built in 1939 out of native stone. This filling station served travelers for decades under the ownership of Logan Thompson. Closed shortly after 2000, by Aaron Perry, 2008. 
in the restroom and a family from Brazil in the restroom. Wow. So, where are you guys from? And that's the guy right there, Aaron. Thank you for keeping the... Yeah, man. Thanks, Aaron. Take care. Come back and see. Where are you from? Yeah, uh, exactly. Yeah. Where? I'm all around. Oh, that's a good yeah. spot to be. See you guys. I can't spell that, but... Yeah, yeah. California plates, but uh, we get around. Awesome. See you guys. So California, where's California? Uh, San Francisco, the area. Okay. All right, Gearhead Curios. That was a great stop. Very cool. sunflower sign. Not a lot of those. This is Nelson's Old Riverton Store. Oh, I wish you could smell it. Wow. Village pie maker, look at the old Coke machine. Good morning. How long has this place been around? 98 years. You haven't been here that whole time. No, sorry to bother you. It's all good. Thank you. Nelson's Old Riverton store on Route 66 in Kansas. Like stepping back in time. And, oh, and look at that shot right there, come on. Now we're gonna Rainbow Bridge. southeast corner in Kansas.
bridge constructed in 1923 over Brush Creek is the only remaining March Arch Bridge on Route 66 listed on the National Historic Registry March 10th, 1983. Very cool. Jeff Fisted. This is the guy who uh, he just took a video of me. I was uh, giving him a hard time about the uh, delivery things on his rental car. <laughs> yeah, you would, you would. yeah, over there. So sorry about that. Thank That's you for the video. Right. Nobody's ever offered to take the video of this thing driving. So, got the Rainbow Bridge. Where are you from? Kansas, Kansas or? No, we're from Perth, Western Australia, in Australia. And Bob's your uncle. He is indeed. Exactly. Well, welcome to the U.S. Yeah, Thanks right. for coming out. Thanks I appreciate so much, it. Mate. Take yeah. care. All right, awesome. Rainbow Bridge. We are off. Where are we going now? Uh, well, we're heading to the Troy. State, where the three states meet. There you go. All right, I'm off to Oklahoma. And then we're heading towards Oklahoma. You're heading towards Santa Monica. That way. We're heading west. West. We're heading west. Excellent. Safe travels, my friend. You too, we'll right? see you. Thank you, sir. And we are back out on the road in the 55. Come on. Oh, and look at that. We even got the historic byway. And we're off. Springs, Kansas. This is the Visitor Information Center. Hello there. You know, I got my pocket for it. I'll give you $5 for it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What year is it? 1955. Automatic. To Chevy. Automatic or standard shift? Uh, automatic. I'll give you ten dollars for it. How far are you going? All the way. How long has this place been around? Mm -hmm. How long has this place been around? Ten years. All right. Yes, yeah, it's been longer than that. It's the Rainbow Bridge. And your first nice time shot. six miles going go up all. Be careful with the speed trap. Ah, uh, thank you. I appreciate that.
Hey, all right. You have 448 miles, Oklahoma 66. You won't be on boat till tomorrow night. Oh, yeah? All right. You want a boat on it? No, thanks. Okay. All right. We are off. Thanks so much. Thank you. Love the pumps. All right, back out on the road. <laughs> 66 Soda Fountain. The Ritz Theater. Oh, and that looks like an old Safeway. I don't know if it is or not. Mid-century, definitely. <laughs>